Hey guys, it's me again. My name is Marsha Malo, and welcome back to Minecraft. Now, just so you know, there might be a certain small cat that is in this office with me. She's very cute. I'll show, like, pictures or something on the screen, but I let her join her, me in my office today while I was recording. And we'll see if I regret it, because she is very <laughs> distracting. Uh, please don't attack any of my cords, okay? Can you do that? Can you do that for me? No, don't step on that! No! Wait, hold on, stop! Wait, hold on, stop, 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 stop. Alright, that was my bad for leaving that out. Uh, crisis averted. Anyways, so, as you can see, I have done some work. That rain is kind of loud, but that's okay. It's fine. Oh, is it slowing? Is it stopping? It's getting quieter. Is that just me? Maybe not. Whatever. Anyways, so, I have expanded. I actually did this a long time ago. <laughs> I did this months ago. See, this funny thing happened to me where I was, like, ready to record, and I was doing great, everything was fine, and then I got really sick for, like, four months or something, and then I couldn't get better again. <laughs> Anyways, I'm excited to get back into the swing of things. There's still a lot here that I have to, like, carve out and whatnot. But I'm not going to come in here right now. Can I, like, turn this off, please? What was it? Weather clear. I won't always use cheats, but I just don't want it to be raining right now. So I feel like I'm, like, shouting. Anyways, as you can also see... I have dug out this path a little bit, I've added lights, and I've added this path. I figured out that uh, on the ground, if you right click with a shovel, it will um, like change the dirt for you. So that's what I used here. And I've kind of broken it up in the middle here, and off to the side, I also did this little thing off camera. I was tempted to do this on camera, but then I decided I was too impatient for that and didn't feel like recording. I added a little campsite here with the furniture mod, and I think it looks really freaking cool. I like it a lot. I'm saying freaking so I don't <laughs> so I don't have to censor myself in case it gets demonetized from my swears. Anyway, never mind that. So we've got that. It's pretty cool. I love how this place looks at night because of all the lights I put up. Uh, of course, lights have no uh, use beyond providing light in peaceful mode. I am in peaceful mode, right? I'm just going to make sure. Yep, I am. Good. Because this is my peaceful world. One of them. One such peaceful world I have, you see. I'm trying to remember if I created this pumpkin farm. I don't remember if I did or if I just... Oh, no, I think I just expanded what was already here. That's right. So, yeah, I've been using these to make jack-o'-lanterns, which, if you didn't know, creates more light than... Uh, standard torch. I've been doing that because, of course, I don't need to make food in peaceful mode. I have some, but you don't really need it because of how fast you heal and whatnot. So, you know, that's pretty cool. And I believe when you're at full health, your hunger doesn't, like, deplete as fast. I'm trying to remember how true that is. I don't remember. But, what is that? Oh, it's just a cloud. <laughs> also, I've put up a few more waypoints. I have... Uh, changed some of their names a little bit, and I've changed their colors. Um, I've done some exploring. I expanded the map a little bit. Um, I actually, I had a dream about this area the other day. That was really funny. <laughs> it was a funny dream. But um, I was also thinking... Alright, let's see. See, I want to kind of expand into the forest, but I also don't want to destroy the forest. I want to like build into it, but I also want to make like a sprawling metropolis. We'll see if I can pull that off, I guess. What I really wanted to do though was because I was sick all through Christmas, I didn't get to celebrate Christmas at my best. I was so sick. Like you guys should have seen me. It was pretty terrible. So I wanted to put up, put up like a small Christmas tree or something in some area and just like have it as a decoration. And I've been trying to figure out where to put that. Um, I mean, it's perfect. We live in a place full of spruce trees. 
Hmm. I was going to, like, grow a tree and then, like, add stuff to it, but I don't know. I don't want to destroy the forest too much. Maybe I'll just use this and... Oh yeah, I was also going to use shears, maybe, to, like, um, like, cut some of the leaves down and, like, change the shape of the tree. I might do that, honestly. This tree over here is perfect, I think. I really like this one. Like, that's that's perfect for a Christmas tree. Are you kidding me? But, um, maybe I'll use this one instead. Uh, what was I gonna do for that, though? I do not remember. <laughs> See, I planned this, like, kind of a really long time ago. <laughs> Man, I planned this so long ago, I just- I don't even remember what my plan was. Uh... So... Don't mind me, I, I just have a cute kitten on my desk. I don't think I have... I don't think this is a very good database for looking up recipes. I was hoping I would have a bunch of decorative pieces. Oh, an iron nugget surrounding a torch makes a lantern. Okay, that actually kind of helps me out. Uh, can I... I uh, how do I escape from this? Oh, that's how, that makes sense. Okay. <laughs> Do I have a crafting table with me? Or hmm. Maybe I should go find the crafting table I left at the campsite because I figured I'd need one there. It looks nice here. Um, uh, oh, that's right. I have plenty of iron because I've been like, you know, digging and stuff. Actually, I'll need more than that. And so, grab my torches and how many should I make? Um, maybe I'll make four for now and see where that goes. It's raining again! <laughs> and now it's nighttime. And there's thunder. Great. Oh, hang on. I have an idea. Hang on. I have an idea. Where are my shears? Okay. Okay, first of all, you know what? This is my... do that how to get inventory back after slash clear well my game crashed great this is just fantastic this is a, this is a great return this is my this is my this is a fantastic return to youtube here quality content everybody okay i guess i'm just gonna have to chalk that up to experience and move on because i just i can't be bothered i can't I can't be bothered to go back and try and fix what I just did. Uh, so I'm just gonna move on. This is what I meant to do. And this, this is what I meant to do. Thank you. God, I'm gonna have to go back and get a bunch of items. Did, was I carrying all my iron? I really hope I was not. Is that just the tax for cheating? It just kicks you out. That's not fair. Yes, that was in fact all of my iron. <sighs> See, this always has to happen, at least once, is uh, you mess things up really badly, and then you don't even have any torches, are you kidding me? And all you can really do in situations like this is to just scream. <laughs> scream as loud as you can. Go out in the middle of the woods where nobody can hear you and just scream. Sachi, excuse you. Can you, like, get out of my way, please? Thank you. I know, you really like laying on that towel, huh? Well, at least I still have wood so I can, like, start over again. Man, that really sucks. I forgot to get cobblestone. Hold on. Fantastic return. This is the best return I've ever had. I don't know what you're talking about. Actually, that time with Breath of the Wild was probably worse now that I think about it. Okay, so because I didn't plan ahead, now I'm going to catch on fire. It wasn't even like I died, I just was an idiot. 
where am I supposed to find more iron? I like... <sighs> okay, you know what? Whatever. It doesn't matter. I'll just make stone tools for now. Well, I guess I can't do my plans on the Christmas tree anymore. So... <sighs> I guess we'll do something else. Until I can get all my stuff back. I really don't feel like foraging for more iron at this point. <sighs> Instead, maybe I'll try to figure out... Because the other thing I wanted to do in this episode was figure out where to put a castle. Because I really want to try building a castle. I know I said I was going to build a skyscraper, but we're going to put a hold on that until I can figure out where this castle goes. You know, maybe I should put it on this area. I called it Crescent Moon Peak. That might be a really cool place for a castle, but it's not very big. And I want this castle to be really big. I could probably build it up into here. I want it to be like a... A castle in the snowy mountains, because I think that would be really cool. Maybe I'll go up this way. That'd be cool. Yeah. Let's go look over there. Oh yeah, I didn't pick up all the coal from here. Oh, that's a relief. I can have torches. I can have torches at least. That's good. Maybe if I find iron again, I'll go back and finish that tree, because I really wanted to do that. Because I missed Christmas! And that's not fair! Christmas is my favorite holiday. I don't deserve to have missed it. I have torches! I have obtained torches. Now I'm glad I was lazy and didn't want to mine up all that coal. <laughs> I mean, can you blame me? There's coal, like, all over the place around here. Oh yeah, I forgot one other thing that I should probably mention. I updated the mod list. It's raining again?! Okay, be careful this time. Type that. Perfect. Basically, if you use an axe, and I believe you have to crouch while cutting a tree down, it cuts the whole tree down in one go. It's sort of similar to the timber mod, which I unfortunately never got to use, but I can't find the timber mod anymore, so I found a different one called Tree Harvester, and it works just as well, so that's cool. Be sure to uh, check the mod list in the description if you're curious about what mods I'm using, because I have put an extensive list down there of all the mods I'm using, and that's what I already said. This is another thing I should probably get back to, but the reason I want to build the castle up here in like a snowy mountain- oh yeah, this is perfect for a castle. The reason I want to build a castle up here is because I wanted to mimic something- there are mountain goats up here! That's awesome. I want to do something similar to- um, there's this castle sort of out of bounds in Kabach Rebuilt, my favorite mod for Oblivion, and I need to get back to that. I started playing it and then I just stopped. <laughs> Probably due to all the other reasons I stopped YouTube for a while. I really hope I stop doing that one day. Oh, hi! Oh, are you a sleepy kitten? Sorry, she's distracting, even when she's not. <laughs> what a cutie. Okay, but which way do I want the castle to be facing? Hmm. You know, this seems like a pretty cool place for a castle, but it's a little bit hidden. That could be like barracks or something. I want to... I want to place- I want to place it where it can, like, overlook the landscape, you know what I mean? And I th think I vaguely want it facing home, so this way, but I don't know. Actually, I changed my mind. I want it here. So, which way- hmm. where do I want the entrance to be? That's what I should be asking. Hmm. Maybe... Let's see. I want to, like, build this into the side of the cliff. That'd be cool. Alright. Here. Oops. 
Excuse you. Like that. And then... Like this. And then this can be our little entrance. Whoops. I'll put some light here. And how far should this wall extend? Maybe just to the cliff. Like here. Yeah, that works. Okay. Um... See, I'm wondering how how ambitious do I want this project to be? Because I think it would be cool if there was like a, also a wall around it. Although I could probably put the wall further down, like around the mountain. Yeah, that'd be sick. All right. So I want this to be a big castle. So maybe this should just be the entrance to the castle. And whoa. What was that? Did you just, like, hurt someone? What? Don't hurt the mountain goats! What did they do to you? Alright. I am almost out of cobblestone. Oh, wait, no, I'm not. I still got some. Okay, cool. Cobblestone is pretty classic for a castle, I feel. So, you know, it's appropriate, I think. How high do I want the ceiling to be? Oh, it's getting dark again. Okay. Ow. Yeah, this works. Oh, this looks interesting. Okay, maybe I'll put a back door on this, because that'd be cool. Oh, excuse me. I am out of cobblestone. That's good. Okay, well, since I'm out of cobblestone, I'm going to start digging this place out. Um, if I dig this out, I'll be able to make the door lower. Yeah, let's do that. Ah, I need more cobblestone. All right. Oh, since it's raining, it's actually snowing. Okay, that's cool. I like that. I don't like that, though. That's thunder. If I can dig deep enough to get to stone, maybe I can get more cobblestone, because that would be ideal. But I don't quite want to dig up what I'm counting as the floor right now. Come on. Please. Well, at least I found coal. That's cool. Ha! Okay, this works. The mountain goats. I love the mountain goats. Okay. Don't need those right now. Cool. Perfect. Sheesh, my hands are so shaky right now. What's going on? Is that just like a side effect of the, the fatigue that has taken over my life? That thunder is so loud in my ears. I hope it's not too loud in the recording. I have made a few mistakes. Um, in which I, you know, um, mess up the audio. Jeez. To the point where, like, the game is louder than my voice, and that's not what I want. Okay, I've got more cobblestone. I think this is as much as I need for now, so I'll leave. That's ideally all gonna be dug out eventually. So there we go. Actually, wait, that's not what I meant to do. <laughs> um, do I want this to be the floor level, actually? Maybe I do. This does go quite a bit higher up. Alright. Let's see. Oh, maybe I could build, like, a wizard's tower. Like the wizard's tower in Oblivion. That's a DLC. It's really cool. It's called Frostcrag Spire. And I can barely hear myself talk through my headphones that are loud in my ears. Okay, how far do I want this to extend? At least this far, so I'll start digging through here. Man, my character must be cold right now. Well, that's good. 
It's always great to lose your shovel. Okay, you know what? This was fun to figure out for a while, but um, I think I might have to come back here, actually. I think there was something else I wanted to do, and I just realized it might help me get iron again. So, how do I do this again? Let's... Oh yeah, that's cool. That's gonna look so cool. Alright. Oh, it's so quiet all of a sudden. It's so quiet all of a sudden. Alright. Um, uh, oh yeah, green is what I'm using for landmarks. And blue is what I've been using for... Um, like structures that I build. So, uh, what color do I set this to? I forget. I think. Uh, so, blue all the way, I think. And then 200? That looks about right. All right. And we'll call it. We'll call it, um, uh, well, I can always change it later, so I'll just call it Snowy Castle. Cool. It's loud again. And if I want to change it, I can always come back. All right, so we can leave. My little thing is going to show up. It looks like a beacon. This place is going to be full of beacons later on. Definitely worth it, though, to not get lost. Oh yeah, I'm definitely going to be abusing my powers. <laughs> oh, that's a drop-off. Uh, the thing that always annoys me about Minecraft is that, like, Whenever I see a cave, I have an instinct to just go into it immediately. But, like, what I should be doing, I think, is, like, marking it with a torch so I can come back later. Because otherwise, I'm just going to spend all day in caves and never, ever get back home. <laughs> and that is not the goal right now. Wait, why is it bright in here? Oh, it's because I... <laughs> okay. Pardon, it's been a while since I've played. Be cool to pull something else at Crescent Moon Peak. I'm already pretty fond of it, just because it's a mountain that's sort of shaped like a crescent moon. I just think that's pretty, pretty sweet. If you know what I'm saying. Ow. <laughs> okay, so what I wanted to do was I found something in here. Yeah, here it is. And I covered it up just... I don't remember why, actually. It wasn't to keep monsters out, because this is a peaceful world, but... I lit up this place. I want to incorporate it into my house somehow, like make it have a big room that looks like a Minecraft cave. Because it is a Minecraft cave. But I'm not sure how. I'm going to have to lower the floor if I want to do it directly, but um, I'm not sure how good of an idea that is. I could just like add a doorway or something. What I wanted was for this room to be deeper, but it's kind of looking like it's about to hit that cave and I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, what to do about that. So, why do I keep looking in these as if new things are just going to suddenly appear? Oh yeah, I need more tools. That's why I was doing this. What the heck was that? What the heck was that? What was that? Did a squid air drown or something? I don't know what that noise was. That was odd. It was definitely the sound of something dying. So if I wanted to expand this out, how was I going to go about doing it? Funny how I accidentally stopped right where this cave started here. I believe this is my spawn. Yeah. <sighs> probably be coming back to this bed more often instead of just typing in time set day and calling it a day because it is a day <laughs> it's a joke 
You can laugh at my joke now. And then this could probably be expanded into a room. Oh, you know what? I could just fill this in and just go directly straight in. Yeah, let's try that. I think, actually, this wasn't part of a cave before. I think I might have dug something out here. But I don't remember what it was. It might have been Doi, right? Because I was collecting that. Actually, yeah, I think that's what it was. God, it's been so long since I've recorded here in this area. And should I fill it in with cobblestone? I think actually I'm gonna fill it with wood because that's what I was gonna make it anyway, I think. And just chug straight forward. Follow me now, once more into the breach. I'm gonna run out of birch wood. I did have a lot more, but somebody decided to be an idiot and type in the wrong command and get rid of her entire inventory. Oh wait, that idiot was me! Okay, this works. Yeah. This goes directly- oh, this is perfect! Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm liking this. I'm liking this a lot. Hopefully, if I'm lucky, I will have neglected some iron in here, so I'll be able to get more iron. And I need to make the ceiling higher, because I swear. I could make this into sort of a wide hallway. That might be cool. I kind of dislike hallways in architecture. Uh, if I can avoid them, I usually try to. But, you know, I prefer open plo- <laughs> I prefer open floor plans to having a bunch of hallways, but, you know. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. Honestly, I could probably just leave it like that. It doesn't look bad. It looks unfinished, but it's cool, you know? I'm not gonna leave it like that. I'm gonna, like, clean it up a little bit more, but, you know, it looks cool is what I'm saying. Just like that. Doesn't look like I left any iron in here. Maybe there just wasn't iron here to begin with. I'm not sure. Here, I hear rustling wind. What are what are like dungeons like if you? <gasps> yes. What are dungeons like if you are like playing in peaceful mode? Do things just not spawn? Can you just walk right up to the spawner and nothing happens? I think so. Actually, I've played on peaceful before. It's just been a while. Oh yeah, baby, we're getting some iron now. That's good, that's good. I'm glad, because like iron isn't that rare, but I was still worried about finding some, like, immediately now when I needed it. You know how it is. Things always seem like they're in an abundance, but then you, like, can't find it when you need it, so, you know. I should probably get more coal, too. There's plenty of coal around here. I can And I had so much iron, too. Jeez. And my pick is about to break. But that's okay, because I soon will be able to make a new one. That is made of iron. An iron pick. A superior pick. I'm trying to remember this really cool place I went to this one time, but I can't remember if it was on this save file or a different one. So, I'm gonna have to figure that one out. Alright, so obviously I've still got a lot of work to do. Uh, you guys can let me know if you want to see a lot of that on camera, or if you'd rather I do it off camera. Um, I'll probably do most of it on camera, but I'm not entirely sure. So we'll let that cook up. And uh, snowball. I don't need that right now. I'd rather have the inventory space. I just... Oh yeah, my lava buckets, because I wanted to try making an ender portal without using a diamond pickaxe. Because I've never actually done that before. I've tried. Haven't quite succeeded yet, because you need a lot of lava for it. 
Oh yeah, I was gonna put the bricks and stuff away. Well, it sure looks like I have an abundance of spruce wood. That's good, at least. Gosh, that is so loud. I'm gonna turn that down in my headphones, because that's just too loud. Yes! My stone pick is on its last leg. Wow. How much you want to bet there's just, like, one more mine left in this pick? No, two, three, four. Oh wow, it's got a lot left in it. I didn't realize that. It's like I, I did all of this digging out off camera and trust me, just digging and nothing else is pretty boring to watch, but I feel like it's different if I'm like building a castle or doing something else that's more interesting. So I don't know, you guys can let me know how much you want to see. <laughs> the one more <laughs> all right well there's that thank you very much for your service all right you have to be careful about that one uh, just the slash clear I feel like that's an unseen danger <laughs> that I didn't realize I didn't realize how immediate it was uh can you please stop that? Just please. Okay, as soon as I have more iron, I will hopefully get back to that tree. But actually, I have another idea instead of using the lanterns. So, I need more shears. Of course I do. There we go. That works. Um. Oh, Sachi looked up. What a cutie. Which tree do I feel okay stripping? Probably this one. This used to have another tree next to it, so that's why it looks weird. And, like, the Tree Harvester mod didn't fully cut it down. So, yeah, there we go. I've got myself some leaves. That's why you, if you want the leaves themselves, you use the shears to cut them down. Cut them out, I guess. Maybe I should just cut this entire tree down, because it's a little bit in the path. Alright, but first I'm gonna strip it so I have the leaves. <laughs> I was about to make a stripper joke, but again, I don't want to get demonetized, so maybe that's not the best idea. Okay, I have 60, that's probably enough. Why didn't that work? Hello? Hmm, that's odd. You're just supposed to hold shift to sneak and then it works. Oh well. That doesn't matter, I guess. Now I have even more spruce wood! Yay! Okay, so what I was gonna do... Cut that out and then put a torch in. So that there would be lights in the tree. Oh yeah, that looks cool. Or, alternatively, I could do it like this, and then like this. Oh yeah, that looks pretty cool. <laughs> that looks cool, doesn't it? And then I can cut uh, these out. So I was wondering if there's a if there was a way to make that look better, but yeah, that's pretty cool. Actually, wait. I have a better idea. We'll wrap them around in a pattern. How does that sound? Yeah? So we'll put that there. Yeah! Alright, this is looking cool. <laughs> it's gonna start looking pretty legit here soon. I think I need lanterns for this. Well, I guess because I could do it. <laughs> there we 
go. I'm now in the tree. Nice. There we go. Um, let's see. So I'm setting again, but that's fine. We'll get to see our tree all lit up. Actually, I should get a pumpkin. Maybe a, a pumpkin might look good as the star. <laughs> Minecraft star on top of the tree. I might want to do two rings of lights, honestly, going around in a spiral. So one here, and actually, if it's just opposite, never mind, I won't do that. This will probably be enough. How are you guys doing? Doing good? Nice. I'm glad. I'm glad to hear. Hanging out with your family? Going out to see movies with your kids? I'm glad. I'm glad to hear it. I'm sort of, I'm sort, I'm sort of starting to consider this series to be more personal. So, um, yeah, just like, you know, because it's sort of chill, it's relaxed, it's comfortable. Unlike in my other Let's Plays, like in Henry Stickman, when I'm shouting and adding a bunch of editing and swearing, and then censoring out the swearing so I don't get demonetized. But, uh, you know. This one could be more chill. This could be more of a chill let's play. I remember having people... I may have already mentioned this before. I don't know. It's been a long time since I recorded a Minecraft episode. But there are people who really liked my old Breath of the Wild series uh, because it was like sort of similar. It was the same idea. It was just calm. It was chill. I didn't yell. There wasn't heavy editing. It was just, you know, it was cool. It was cool. There we go. Don't miss that jump. And it looks like... Hmm. Oh, I know. I'll put a torch here. And then put a leaf here. There we go. And then... I should have I gone to get the pumpkin before I did this, honestly. Ah, well. I'll go all the way over here to grab a pumpkin. These grow in really fast. Is the tick rate just a lot higher in peaceful mode? Is that what's going on? Because I swear I don't remember them growing in that fast. Cheers, you! Jeez, that actually startled me. Thor is angry. Apparently what I'm doing displeases him. Oh yeah, that looks cool. I like that. Alright, there we go. If I was doing this more legit, I might um, actually get a mod for Christmas decorations. Oh no! The leaves are decomposing. Alright, no torch on the top then. But I will place... Okay, first of all... Oh wait, no, I need to carve it first. Ah, ah! I forgot you have to do that before you... Ah, alright, hold on. One sec. Is it... How do you do that? Oh, that's right, you use the shears. Ah, it's really been a long time, hasn't it? Carved out pumpkin, jack-o'-lantern, and boom. It's more Halloween than it is Christmas, but I think that can be forgiven, considering the circumstances. There we go. And... Alright. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. <laughs> Overly decorated tree. Ah, there's a dirt up there. Uh, oh, well, I'll just let it go away on its own. That's fine. It doesn't matter. Okay, anyway. 
feel like what I also want to do is take some of these flowers and just put them closer around the bottom of the tree. I think that'll be pretty cool. Yeah, that's cool. I'm gonna run out of flowers before I get all the way around, though. Oh, I only need one more, so it's fine. It doesn't matter. What are these, dandelions? I like dandelions. They're cool. That works. Yeah, I really like that. That looks cool. It's even got a similar color scheme, except for that freaking piece of dirt up there. That's annoying. But other than that, it looks great, doesn't it? Looks fantastic. Alright, so that's my little Christmas celebration, I guess. I actually thought about putting, uh... Maybe I should put my crafting table. Nah, I need to keep this. I don't know, I'll put something under there to act as a present. I think that would be pretty cool. Maybe a decorative block, once I build up enough stuff to be able to do that. Okay, well, I've been recording for almost 46 minutes, so I guess it's time to end the episode. Oh yeah, I forgot I had a shader mod on. I should keep a torch out more. That works, I think, I guess. <laughs> Man, I'm just forgetting all the controls, aren't I? Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!